been an outstanding week here in Kansas City at the National Junior Angus Show. It's been a little warm, but it's been a fantastic week. It's the big stage for our, uh, our summer of activities for, and really a showcase of our, our young people. And it's just been a, a fantastic week. And we've got one of those outstanding young people that agreed to come and join. It's Miss Alex Casatordo. thanks for being here. Uh, how about introduce yourself just a little bit? Well, thank you, Mark, for having me. It's an awesome opportunity. My name is Alex Cazatordo. I am currently the chairman of the National Junior Angus Board. I'm a junior animal science major at Texas A&M University. You know, ag and Angus is a big part of who I am, and so I'm just happy to be here this week. You've had a busy week, and it's obviously it, it, the busyness uh, was before this week, all the planning that you had. Maybe just a couple of the highlights uh, so far of, of the week for you. Yeah, so highlights for the week have just, you know, getting to see the juniors compete on the national stage. It's, it's an awesome opportunity. They get to create these friendships that'll last a lifetime. And my first one was in 2010, and I haven't missed one since. So I've got to see how it could impact my life. And the best part of the week for me is seeing my role on the junior board and how that is, uh, you know, putting that impact on the next generation of Angus juniors. Most everybody thinks about the National Junior Show. We think about, obviously, the show that's going on behind us, and we're in the own show here today, and, and, and it's the competition's been in, incredible. There's a lot of other things that go on. Obviously, so many contests. I wouldn't even have a guess of how many contests that there were. I got to judge, uh, uh, I got to judge a cook-off contest. I got to actually judge the poster contest yesterday, and got to see some of those. There's also a lot of mentoring that's going on and networking. Talk a little bit about that and some of the things that maybe not everybody sees. Okay, so definitely I would say the National Junior Angus Association, one of the best parts of Junior Nationals is the networking and connections that are made. So personally, in, in regards to mentoring, so at my first Junior Nationals in 2010, um, I got the mentor, Caitlin Corsentino. So she was on the junior board also a few years back. I think she got on in Tulsa in 2015. And today, still to this day, um, we're very close friends. I actually just went to her wedding. And so it's awesome to see how, you know, just a small connection you make with a younger junior member can have a lasting impact. And so it's crazy to see, you know, just how far the Angus network and the Angus family continues to follow you even after your time in the association. And so it's something that we should never take for granted. And I think it's one of the best parts of being a part of this awesome breed association. Well, it is. It's, a, it's an incredible program. It's so fun for, for, for me to stand back and watch the young people come up to you as somebody now that they that they look up to and admire and aspire to be. I uh, got to hear some of the candidates that are running for the junior board, uh, the new six, as we call them, that are coming in. You know, one of the questions was about, you know, how do you connect? How would you connect with a uh, someone that you see that's, uh, that's maybe not uh, tied into the programs? You know, they reference those people that were impactful when they were young. And and uh, it's just so fun to watch that and these kids light up. You're an incredible role model. Thank you for all you do. Thank you for your hours and hours and hours of service and leadership. We thank you and I really look forward to all the exciting things you're gonna do in the future. I thank you for you know creating and fostering the relationship with the National Junior Angus Association to cre create these memories for all the juniors. So thank you for having me and for this opportunity. <laughs>